Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm coming at y'all barefaced, it, natural, um, with a bonnet on and no lip gloss. So I'm gonna put on lip gloss right now because y'all know I don't like film with no dry lips. So you guys, I think that's a little bit better. I decided to do a wash and go. I never do wash and goes because I don't think my hair really likes wash and goes. I don't think I have wash and go hair. But since I'm going to Chicago Friday or Thursday, one or the other, and I will be wearing a wig to Chicago, I looked at it like, let's do wash and go. It's only gonna be in your head for like a good three, four days anyway. So you might as well film it see how it goes it'll probably be a fail but at least you get the fail on film <laughs> so i just got my bonnet on i took my braids out yesterday i washed my hair i deep conditioned my hair and i felt like my hair was falling out but i think i was just being overly dramatic ah! Ah! Oh, oh. But I did lose a lot of hair after taking those braids out. So I was like, okay, I don't want to really manipulate my hair right now. We're gonna try wash and go on camera for the first time. And I look crazy. I look like Felicia. So we gonna, um, we're not gonna take out all the sections. Since we working with the back right now, I'm just gonna put these up like I normally do. I don't know what products to use for wash and go because I don't do wash and goes. I just decided I'm gonna take the, the Wet Line Extreme Gel. I'm gonna try that. And I have the Quick Curls from Miss Jessie's. Y'all, this product was $32. Did I pay for it? No, because the way that my coins work, I'm not spending $32 on hair care. I can't do it. But it was $32 and I got it from my good Judy because he didn't enjoy it uh, and he gave it to me. So thank you, Josh. And the next product is the Coily Custer. I did pay for this. This was $16. You know, $15, $16 is in my price range. Then um, $32, she tried it. He didn't like it, so that's why he gave it to me. If we buy products, because he has natural hair too, so. Speaking of the devil, girl, I was just talking about you in my video. Girl, how bad is a bitch I am? Hi, yeah. Girl. Lay, lay, girl. A few moments later. So that was my good Judy, y'all. So I'm back though. I washed my hair with the Mayel pomegranate and honey. I don't know if it was the product that made my hair feel like it was falling out or what it was, but um, this leave-in conditioner though, this is good. I like this. So I'm gonna probably do a video using this because y'all, I love this. He gave me that too, so thanks, Josh. We have our water bottle. We have the Miss Jessie's Curly Custard, and we have the Miss Jessie's Quick Curls and the Extreme Wet Line Gel. Let's give this a try. I'm gonna wet my hair. I'll put a good little amount of that Mayel's Leave-In Conditioner. My hair is still definitely moisturized now that I wet it. So we're going to do little small sections like this. And that leave-in conditioner smell really, really good. Probably use one or the other one. Now this $32 Quick Curls from Miss Jessie's, it says, for a beautiful halo of soft velvety curls, apply with a teaspoon to damp, apply about a tea tablespoon of damp sec, wait, what the fuck is wrong with me? I can read y'all. For a beautiful halo of soft velvety curls, apply about a tablespoon to damp sections of hair. Do not rinse out, dry naturally, or use the fuser for more value. I don't think I need to use the curly custard and the quick curl, so I think I'm going to use one or the other. Since I'm so excited to see what this feels like, since it was $32, we're going to try this one. Instead of using the coily custard and the quick curls, we're only going to use the quick curls. I'm kind of excited about this for some reason. I surely wasn't expecting this. It's white. Um, I like the way it feels though. It don't smell bad. I don't know what it smells like. And I think I'm just gonna shingle it with some of this extreme line gel. Ooh. Okay. Hopefully it don't leave that white residue that it has. And I'm just basically taking little small sections. Just gonna separate. so far i 
can complain. When it comes to doing the back of my hair with wash and goes, it always works. The type of hair I have in the back is different than the middle and the other parts of my hair. So I'm not surprised by how it's working. Once we get to the middle and it does that, then I'm gonna be surprised. Before the back, my hair is definitely, I have a good grade of hair in the back. I mean, I can't lie, I do like this Quick Curls product. I like the way it feels on my hair. I don't know about $32, but we gonna see after this is all said and done. Now let's try this $15 brush to separate it and see how that works. Okay. It definitely did the separating, so I don't have to do that. I can just kind of go through and separate as needed. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, like, I'm liking this so far. This is cute. Like, y'all, yeah, this look like some deep wave bundles, honey. Okay, natural hair. Let's keep going. See, and I feel like this is where my hair starts to change. But so far, it still looks really good. So I'm gonna do this section and then come back when I'm doing this. Get into these curls, y'all. Like, do you see the definition? Like, honey, can you say shook? Like, yes! Get into it! This is not a fail. This is real. Okay, Miss $32 product. Let's get into the front. Cause I'm still even shook about this right here. Like, yeah, this is like the middle part. And honey is giving me all types of Dominican honey. Like, yes, girl, I'm so shook right now. Like, oh, let's finish y'all. I'm like super happy though. Let me find out I can rock me a uh, dance and grow honey. Uh, I mean, <laughs> see y'all, I'm so excited that I can't even talk right now. But let me find out, I can rock me a natural uh, wash and go. I am super excited. I'm just curious to see how it's gonna look when it's all said and done. So I don't wanna get my hopes up too high, but y'all like, yes. Y'all, the front of my hair, it don't play no games. So if, if these two products can whip her to shape, I will be like so. Are we gonna be doing wash and go videos? This quick curls, um, you know, Miss $32, it definitely has a certain smell to it. I don't know what the smell is, but it definitely has a certain smell that I don't technically agree with, but it's not a bad smell either. Get some of this extreme wet line gel and put it all over. I just feel like even my curl pattern in the front is just really different than the back. Okay, okay. I'm not as excited with the front, but we're gonna keep going. It's definitely lots of definition in my curls. Take Miss $32. Put that amount. I'm gonna put a little bit more. It says a tablespoon for, and I think I've been definitely not generous enough. So I wanna definitely make sure I'm generous in the front because this is where the naturalness kicks in and Freya starts to pile up. Only thing I don't like is the white cast is starting to create. I feel like that's just natural since the since Miss Thirty Two Dollars is white. done 
with one half and I do really like the definition. The front definitely looks a little bit different than the back and that's only because my hair is two different textures uh, or maybe three different textures, I don't really know. But do this section off camera, come back with my makeup done, this section done, and tell y'all my final thoughts. I'll be back. It's not fully dry like the curls is dry but the inside is not dry and the back like the nape area is not dry but I'm gonna take this uh, headband off so I'm gonna gel this down and put like a bobby pin on it and I'm gonna gel this side down Now I'm going to lay down my edges. Y'all see the definition? Kia, you can let him out. You can let him out because I'm going to hear her crying in the thing. So just let him come in here. So you guys, this is the finished look. Clearly, <laughs> he wasn't gonna let me finish, so say hi. Look, <sighs> no, okay, you in here with mommy now, but you guys, this is the finished look. I like it, I really do. The definition is real. Really pretty. It is down there now. It's like this little part didn't shrink up. So that little piece is just, I don't know, doing its own thing. But you guys, this is the end of the video. Let me know what y'all think about this wash and go. I think it's really cute. Especially once it dries on the inside because it's not dry right now. You gotta look right there, Pootie. That's that's you looking at yourself. You gotta look right here. Right here, look. You see all this stuff that you wanna play with? You see? Right here. You wanna say bye bye to the camera? Say bye bye. If you're new to this channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe link down below, like this video, share this video, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, y'all.